Hi, this is Dr. Denver from TopWorkoutSecrets.com and I thought I would share with you this morning another green smoothie recipe. I'm getting ready to make it, take it with me for my work day. See, I'm dressed in my work clothes for um, the day. So this smoothie is called the Purple Banana. And so it starts with two bananas. And I'm gonna make sure your bananas are nice and ripe. These are just fairly ripe. Um, when bananas have brown speckles on them is when they're actually ripe. And before they're ripe, they're harder to digest and uh, have more likely to give you a, a stomach ache. Plus they just don't taste as good. They're not as sweet. So you wanna make sure your, your bananas are ripe. Um, that way the enzymes are active to help digest them. So two bananas and pear. And all I've done is wash it, pull the stem off, pull the rest of the pears going in. And a cup of frozen blackberries. Use fresh if in a place where you can get fresh and it's the right season. But today I'm needing to use frozen ones. And I'm going to put it in about, oops, maybe if I don't pour it on the counter, a cup of water and blend that up. in and today what I'm putting in is organic spring mix so just a mix of different oops, baby greens that one up. tell I'm in a hurry I'm kind of late for work this morning so I'm gonna put three big handfuls in Vitamix, but you don't have to. You just may have to do things, cut them up smaller and do things in smaller batches with a regular blender. Um, I happen to already have a Vitamix before I started doing green smoothies, so that's what I use. A taste, grab a spoon real quick. Give it a taste. I usually taste to see if I can put in more greens, if I can tolerate more greens in there. That's pretty good. Do a little bit more greens. And a little bit more water. With me. I drink a thicker one here, but it's harder out of my fruit cup to drink the thick one. Bananas, people think of potassium, but actually bananas have quite a bit of vitamin C and vitamin K and B6, <coughs> excuse me, quite a bit of B6. And B6 is really, it's 
good for nerve conduction, is really good for blood sugar regulation. And, <clears throat> excuse me. Vitamin K is involved with blood clotting, your ability to, for your blood to clot when you have a wound. And then pears are also high in vitamin C, vitamin K, and potassium themselves. And then you have the blackberries, which have lots of antioxidants. All those dark berries have lots of antioxidants and also has vitamin K and manganese and folic acid. And again, manganese has been found to be missing in uh, upwards of 37% of the American population because they're not eating fresh foods, but the manganese is, is readily available if you eat uh, fresh, a lot of fresh foods in your diet. And green smoothie is just the easiest, most convenient, best way um, try these recipes and you'll be glad you did. You'll just feel more energetic. As somebody said, this is my morning coffee. Um, gives me a lot more energy without the crash. And um, so give it a try. Again, that's the purple banana smoothie. And this is Dr. Deborah from topworkoutsecrets.com. Give this recipe a try. Let me know what you think. You can vary the greens. I'm just using what I happen to have on hand. Original recipe calls for kale and probably some spinach. And um, tell me what you think. So catch you next time. Dr. Deborah from topworkoutsecrets.com. Have a